now here in the left hand section here in the media pool you will find all of the files and videos which you have imported from your pc to the resolve now the two easiest way to import files from your pc to resolve is the first is just go to the media section and then search here and then find the folder where you have saved all the files and then select the files and drag it here into the master pool and the second is just go to the folder where you have saved all the files and then select the files and then drag it here into the resolve and here into the master pool now a window will pop up and it is asking us the clip have different frame rates than the current project setting now if you want to change the frame rates of all of these clips so it can match to the project setting click on change and if you don't want click on don't change i will click on change now here you can increase and decrease the icon size of your videos you can also arrange it in different order and you can arrange it in list view or icon view and if you are working on a large file you can search here uh, about the videos and then use that clip in your uh, project after that in this side you will see two windows the first window is source window and the second window is timeline preview now source window is very important and useful feature of resolve you can easily cut in and cut out different clips uh, and use that clips here in your project now for example if i want to load this clip into the source window i will double click on this clip and you can see it's already loaded here into the source window now i use jkl uh, keys to move it backward forward and to stop it j is to move it backward and l is to move it forward and k is to stop it you can also use arrow keys to move it frame by frame like this so i will click on l and it will move it forward now i want to cut this video from here so i will click on i i stand for cut in now again if i want to move it forward i will click on l now i want to cut out this clip to this point so i will click on o o stand for cut out now it cut in and cut out this clip for us now in order to move this clip from here to the timeline i will just drag this clip here to the timeline and you can see uh, resolve automatically created the video track for us this video does not have audio so it only created a video track for us now for example if you are working on this clip this clip have audio i will double click on this clip and it will load it here in our uh, source uh, window now one thing if i see the waveform of uh, waveform of audio of this clip it will be easy for me to cut uh, out this image so i will click on these three dots and i will click on show full audio clip waveform and you can see it show full audio waveform so if i want to clip uh, cut this image from here i will click on i and i will cut it to this extent i will click on o now it cut in and cut out this clip for us now if i drag this clip here you can see it also created the audio track for us okay i will leave it here now for example if you don't want to see this uh, source window here and you want more real estate uh, space for your uh, timeline preview you can click on this icon and it will uh, disable the source window and you can also minimize the media pool so you have more uh, real estate space for your timeline window and you can also uh, adjust it in different order according to your own taste you can uh, decrease your timeline window and increase your timeline and you can increase your uh, timeline preview or stuff like that you can uh, arrange it according to your own stuff you can also uh, click on effect library and if you want to minimize it just double click on it